Well, traditionally, parents hit the streets with their kids to go trick-or-treating, but here in Bakersfield, a very popular alternative, Safe Halloween. Good evening, I'm Tim Callahan. That event has been held at the Kern County Museum for more than two decades. Tonight, 23ABC's Alyssa Flores is there as the first of two nights wraps up. Alyssa. Tim, a big turnout, a huge success for night one as always. And for many, safe Halloween at the Kern County Museum has become their primary Halloween tradition. Candy, costumes, and community. For over two decades, Safe Halloween has been an alternative trick or treat event for Bakersfield, while also raising money for the Kern County Museum. Zachary Gonzalez says it's all made possible by 50 generous donors, groups and businesses that set up trick-or-treat candy stops. The next two days, we expect about 6,000 trick-or-treaters. Each night, we prepare for about 3,000 kids a night. Some like to come the night before Halloween to double up on candy. I think people are trying to double dip, yeah. While others, like Israel Montesino and his family, are opting to skip the traditional house-to-house -house route altogether. No. No. No, we're doing it tonight so that it's in a controlled, safe area for the kids. And they say they don't feel like they're missing out on anything. No, with them being so young, um, uh, when they're older, we'll probably do the walk around the neighborhood. But right now, we like the fact that it's, 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 it's really enclosed and safe. This isn't just a trick-or-treat event. It's an all-around Halloween festival. So in addition to the 50 trick-or-treat stops that you'll get to partake in, we have uh, George the Giants out here as part of our entertainment. A magician, we have costume contests. And there's also great photo opportunities out here. Um, we have a fancy little Snapchat filter that people can use. So we make it really interactive and very fun for people. It's a great night out with your family. If you didn't get to make it out tonight, or even if you did, night two of Safe Halloween continues tomorrow, and we're going to have all of the information like times and ticket pricing up on our website, turn to 23.com. From Central Bakersfield, Alyssa Flores, 23 ABC. Saw some great costumes there, Alyssa. Thanks for that. If you're looking for some Halloween fun to do tomorrow, you can head to our website, turn to 23.com. We've got a whole list of activities, trunk or treat events, and other fun things to check out. Again, that's online at turn to 23.com.